Mr. Cole. So when do you start calling me Ethan? Ethan. Thank you. You're being very amicable today. So you prefer me being hostile? No, I don't think so. Well, Ethan, this is one of our many warehouses. We use Warehouse 3.0 technology, and each of our loading docks is equipped with auto scanning and data. Sarah, there's no need for an RFID. Okay, I'm very aware. And I'm impressed. Why after a year? Sarah, do you really not remember? I think you're doing this because you want me. Thanks. Be careful. Before we proceed with our deal, why are you so fixated in acquiring my company? There are many others out there just like mine. And why after a year? Sarah, do you really not remember? Remember what? Let's just say that I'm finishing what I started a year ago. I saw potential. And I know how to run a company very well. And you know our business. We acquire, we reorganize, and we sell. And we do it all for the good. I find that hard to believe. What? I think you're doing this because you want me. I was unexpected. What the hell do you want? I was unexpected. You know what's more unexpected? What the hell, Sarah? Don't bother. The pass goes six digits. That means there's 900 million possible combinations. You'll be an old man by the time you just up blast. What the hell do you want? Hey, Aunt Maggie, what do you know about the Cole Capital Group? Nanny for the day. What is your tummy craving today? So when's mom gonna be back? You know, it depends. You know, it could be a day or could be a day or two. Okay, you're acting really shady. Why are you and mom acting like this? What's going on lately? Shouldn't you like get um, ready for your soccer practice? Well, I'm not gonna go tonight actually. I probably should stay back. Do some homework for, uh, for college. You know, Justin, you don't have to give up on your soccer practice for college, you know. Sometimes the things that we love and the things that we have to do for life, they can go hand in hand. Hey, Aunt Maggie, what do you know about the Cole Capital Group? If you don't make up your mind by then, we're both going to be locked in here until we die of starvation. So what's it gonna be? You're being dumb. You played dirty. The IRS agent, that was a shit move. Threatening me is the dumbest business strategy anyone could make. You gotta work hard for what you want. Yeah, because you worked so hard to lock us in this warehouse together. I never said threats don't work. I want you to call the board. Tell them after investigating our warehouses, you've decided to pull out of the acquisition because it's a very bad deal. I've got 28% left on my phone. If you don't make up your mind by then, we're both going to be locked in here until we die of starvation. 
So what's it gonna be? You are fucking crazy. I don't think you would unless you want to look like an incompetent dumbass. You are fucking crazy. Do you know that? I'm just fighting fire with fire. Well, how do you know that I'm not going to call the board and the second I leave here, call them back and say I changed my mind? I heard you and your brothers are fighting for ultimate reign over the company. I don't think you would unless you want to look like an incompetent dumbass. You did your research. Wow. A man as high profile as you, it really wasn't that hard. 15%. Hmm. Do not test me, Sarah. Even if I wanted to call the board, I can't because they are asleep. So let me out of here. Consequences of what? Well, there's no one here, Sarah. So let me out of here, and we can figure all this out in the morning, huh? It's almost 9 a.m. in Paris. The board should just be starting their day. Why do you think I picked the time I did to lock you in? You should be flattered. At least you're worth planning everything ahead for. But did you even consider the consequences? The consequences of what? Well, there's no one here, Sarah. It's just me and you, and you disabled all your surveillance system so that nobody would know what happens here. It's just me and you, Sarah. No one else. I'm giving you one last chance. Open the goddamn door. Get off me! You should have thought of that before you thought of this stupid fucking plan. You wouldn't. I would. I'm giving you one last chance. Open the goddamn door. No. Open it. No! Sarah, open the door. Give me the phone. Give me the phone. Give me the phone. I'll call the board. There, are you happy? Can you let us out now? Sarah? <sighs> yes. Cancel it. I just told you, I tore Laurent Enterprises warehouse. It is no longer a profitable acquisition. I, I, kn I know what I said before, okay? Cancel it. The decision is made. There, are you happy? Can you let us out now? Sarah? 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 Sarah, there's something you should know. Hey, Sarah. Are you okay? Where, where am I? We are at Ethan Coles. How? What are you doing here? Um, Why am I here? Ethan called me because I'm listed as your emergency contact, and you're here because... Where's you... Ethan? 
Oh, he's downstairs talking to his private doctor. He called him to check on you. Sarah, there's something you should know. What? Do I have cancer? You don't have cancer. You're pregnant.